Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Krypton Season 1. So today we're going to be doing my review for Episode 3, so if you do go on to enjoy this video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any Krypton videos later this year, because we will be making lots of videos each week for Krypton. So first off, I want to say I'm really sorry that I had to skip out on Episode 2. I was away in America, and I had no way of actually uploading that video or making it in the first place. And so today we're going to be moving on to episode 3 so not too much major stuff happened in episode 2 it's rather just a continuation and there was a few little easter eggs here and there but there wasn't too much so same with episode 3 there was quite a bit going on in the episode although it was mainly contained to one or two storylines so there's not too much to talk about but we'll go over the important stuff in this video and I'll give my review. So overall this episode was really enjoyable. Like I said in the first episode, I really do like the cast. And again I really connected with these characters, even the evil characters like the voice of Rao or even some of the members of the House of Vex, I actually connected with them. And throughout the episode we get the gist of Lyta and her character's actual story arc for the first part of the season at least. And that is now she's in command, she had the battle line last episode and she is the commander now. The Rankless initiative actually takes place and she stops her own army from actually shooting the Rankless just because they're going to attack and basically she tries to control them although one of her soldiers goes rogue and actually kills the Rankless and they just assume the fact that they are Black Zero because they didn't want this person who was saying nothing not to die and so she's arrested and obviously that's really exciting for us as a viewer because we really sympathize with the Rankless and now we do sympathize empathize for lighter a bit more than say we did before and so she's in command so things are going to be changing around there and throughout the episode the main other storyline is the Brainiac storyline so Brainiac sends out a parasitical mechanical device which can actually take over living organisms and that's what he uses on every planet that he intends to collect so Brainiac takes over Seg's friend and takes all the data needed for Brainiac's plan to initiate and so Brainiac is coming so we should probably expect him next episode, episode 4, and there's going to be a lot of stuff to do with the voice of Rao in next episode, so look forward to that because he's really ominous, and they released a sneak peek, and he is a Kryptonian, so that's one thing, although I have this theory that he is maybe somehow connected to Brainiac, considering that he has a very mechanical voice, even when he has the helmet off, so something's going on there, but we'll have to wait and see for that. So Brainiac is coming, and there was just one small easter egg that I spotted out in the episode, and that that was the hunting blade that was said to be from a Daxamite. So if you guys didn't know, on Supergirl right now we have the character of Monal. He's from Daxam, and there was a lot of Daxamite stuff last season on Supergirl. And basically, who the Daxams are, they are the neighbors of Krypton. And so that's just a big Easter egg to the Superman and Supergirl lore in the DC universe. So maybe we should expect some Daxamites to show up at some point, considering they are neighbors and they did go to war at one point in Krypton's history. So thank you guys so much for watching. And if you did enjoy this Krypton video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment and share it with your friends because I intend to make a lot of Krypton videos. And if your friends are watching it and they want some explanations or they want to see my reviews and my breakdowns for Krypton season one and obviously the future seasons if we get more future seasons please be sure to share it around and anyway guys I will catch you guys later goodbye